In this video, we're going to find a quadratic function, um, or you might call it a parabola, given a vertex and a point that is on the function. So uh, we're going to use something called vertex form here. And what vertex form is, you might see it one of two ways. So you might see y equals a times the quantity x minus h squared and then plus k. Or uh, alternatively, you might sometimes see it as y minus k equals a the quantity x minus h squared. Um, and you can see the difference between the two is that uh, you take the first one, you subtract k from both sides, and you get the second one. Uh, I'm not really sure which one's more common, to be honest, uh, but I'm going to use the first one that I wrote in this video. Um, and in either of these forms, the vertex is the ordered pair h, comma k. So I'm going to try to color code it through that, the video. And uh, let's do a problem. So we're given the vertex, and it is 4, 3, and we're given a point that is uh, on our quadratic, and that's the point negative 2, 5. So you have to memorize the vertex form so that you can use it. So what I'm going to do is, to do the problem, I'll first write down the vertex form. And now I'm going to make the substitution of uh, h and k. So I'm going to substitute uh, for the vertex. So I get y equals a, the quantity x minus 4 squared, and then plus 3. So I made those substitutions. Now that's like an intermediate step. I'm kind of done there. I'm going to put a box around it to help you kind of focus in on what I've done so far. Um, the next thing I do is I move on and I use the point. So the ordered pair that I'm given is negative 2, 5. And that means that uh, in the function that I put in the box, I can replace the y with 5 and the x with negative 2. And it should be true, and I'll be able to solve for a. So that's what I'm going to do now. So I get 5 equals a times the quantity negative 2 minus 4 squared, and then plus 3. Um, so in the next step, I'm going to subtract 3 from both sides. Uh, to get 2 equals, and then uh, negative 2 minus 4 is negative 6, and then squared. So 2 equals a, the quantity negative 6 squared. So those parentheses are really important because when you square a negative, it becomes a positive. Um, so in the next step, 2 equals 36a, um, which means a is 2 divided by 36, but then that simplifies, so I should probably do that. And a is 1 over 18, so I put a box around that to also help you focus. I'm going to combine these two things now, so I'm going to take uh, the thing in the first box, and I'm going to substitute for a. So my final answer is uh, y is 1 18th, uh, the quantity x minus 4 squared plus 3. And that's the equation of the quadratic having that vertex and passing through that point. Uh, so we can do one more, uh, just for practice. So if you know what you're doing, you can stop watching now. Otherwise, this can't really hurt. Um, in this case, the vertex has uh, coordinate to negative 5, 1. And that's a little bit different, but not really. Um, so I start off again, you have to write this down, uh, or at least I definitely recommend you write it down. Now I'm going to make my substitution, so I get y equals a, the quantity x minus negative 5, so notice all the parentheses I put in there, um, and then that's squared and then plus 1. Uh, I put all the parentheses in because now we have minus a negative, so I can simplify that into plus 5. Um, and that's my intermediate step, so I'm going to box it so that you know where it came from. In the next step, we use the ordered pair that we were given that's on the curve, so uh, 0, negative 3. Um, 0 is always a good coordinate if you have it, uh, because it makes things simpler. So negative 3 equals a, the quantity 0, plus 5 squared, and plus 1. Uh, subtract 1, or no, I'm just square that, so I get negative 3 equals uh, a times 25, plus 1. Uh, now subtract 1 from both sides. Negative 4 equals 25a. So a must be negative 4 over 25. Put a box around that. And again, combine those to get my final answer. So there you have it. That's how you can find the uh, equation of a quadratic or a parabola given a vertex and a point that is uh, on the curve. Hope you found this helpful. Good luck.